My name is Morten Ritz from the company HMN. This presentation is about the Nielsen Line shower commode chairs. In the picture you will be able to see three chairs, but in fact there are six, because all of them have interchangeable backrest. It's either a net weave or it's a plastic one, but they can be switched on all of them. So you have, in basic, you have six of them. All chairs are not completely as simple when you get them. This standard one, for example, if you look at the back, you will be able to see two screws there, two screws there, and you mount the backrest on, and you put the armrest on, and you put the um, wheels on. It's more or less the same frame we have used on all chairs. All of them are 150 kilos. Seats are the same. Armrests are the same. Seats are actually quite easy to take off. And then you can clean it uh, and then you can put them on again. As I told you, all of them comes with the uh, footrests included in the chair. All of them are angle adjustable here. And you can see this one, we actually moved it a little, so you can see there is a difference. All of them, you are able to also angle the foot plates in order to accommodate the, uh, the user who have to sit in the chair. Standard one comes with 100 millimeter wheels. This is 125 in front and 24 inches, and this is 125. For all of them, since it's more or less the same frame we are using, we do use the exact same uh, bedpan, which is easily put in from behind. One thing I haven't mentioned yet is that the chair itself are lighter than normal chairs are, because these are made out of aluminum, which is, is uh, lighter than uh, stainless steel. But in order to get the same strength, we have to increase the size of the tubes. That's why it's slightly bigger than our other stainless steel chairs. For all of them, because the, same, uh, uh, the seats are the same, you will be able to put a, a urine funnel on here and put it like this, which would help keep the urine inside the bucket or inside the toilet. All of these can, chairs can go over the toilet. If for any reason the user have a tendency that the leg falls back there, you are able to put on a calf rest. This is more convenient to have on a tip chair, but it can of course also be used on this one. I will put it on the, the tip chair because it's more natural to have it here like this and this will avoid the uh, legs to fall back. Since the seat are made out of plastic, sometimes it could be too hard to sit on. That's why we do have a soft seat, which is able to be put on like this, of, again, on all three chairs. Some people are using this chair not for toileting, but they are using for bathing only, and they would like to have a lid on it, then you are able to also uh, have a lid that has this shape. There could again be uh, users who would like a s even softer uh, seat. Then you can take our pressure relief seat, which fits over the Nielsen line. So, and it, then you will be able to have a softer seat. This one will accommodate through the gravity of the patient and the heat, so the seat will actually form itself like the uh, so it fits the user that are sitting on it. There are few other things to mention is that on this chair and this chair, it's not necessary to have some sort of lock because these two chairs do not tip in any way. But for this one, the arm rest is actually uh, have a lock here where you are able to lock it when the chair is tilted. For this one specifically, there could be users where they would like to have some sort 
of uh, support sitting in the chair because they can be a little worried when you uh, tilt it back. So you are able to put this crossbar on and you would uh, put it on like this and they have the user have something to hold their hands on. Because this is a tilt in space chair, it's nice and sometimes necessary to have a headrest. We do have six different kinds of headrest, but I have shown the one that we would prefer because this one is, as you can see, high adjustable and it could, and I will turn this a little, you're able to move it like this and going back here, you're able to angle it like this, but you can also close it and open it like this. Another thing is for this one, not for the other two ones, we have a set of side supports and those two fits in the hole we have here on the back and I will be able to put this one in here like this and I put this one in like this. This chair is of course the Tilton Space. This is not electric, this is with what we call a gas tip which means you are able to release this handle and it goes forward minus 5 degrees and backward 35 degrees like this. So this is the concept of the uh, Nielsen Line Sour Commode chair. There are more information on our website and thank you for watching.